Roth IRAs have become extremely important as income management tools. They've been traditionally seen as a way to grow assets tax-free for a family legacy, but all of a sudden people are realizing tax-free distributions are a great way to keep your income down for purposes of Medicare premiums, um, taxation of Social Security benefits, and things like that. Tax-free income is a very great thing to have. Once you have a Roth IRA, you can pretty much take out money any time you want to. You can always take your own money back tax-free, and the earnings you can take out tax-free once you're over 59 and a half and have had an account for five years. Getting the Roth IRA is the tricky part because the only way you get one uh, is by either making your annual IRA contribution to a Roth IRA, so that's $5,500 or $6,500 a year, or taking money out of a traditional plan and transferring it to a Roth IRA, which is a taxable event. You're taxed just as if you had taken a distribution from the IRA. Because um, an IRA conversion to a Roth IRA is a taxable event, it's pretty hard for someone to sign up for just a straight out conversion at their top rate. I don't think any client is gonna say, oh, I'll convert a million dollar IRA to a Roth IRA and write a check for $400,000 of taxes. No way. But we look for ways to people, to, for people to get a Roth IRA cheaply or even free. And the IRS last year opened up ways for people who already have after-tax money in their 401k plan or their IRA to convert that money tax-free to a Roth IRA. That is something that every advisor is going to want to do for their client who has after-tax money in a plan or in an IRA. The way to do it is um, you have to have participation in a qualified plan and plus after-tax money someplace. But for example, if you are leaving your company, time to retire, you're gonna take your money out of the 401k plan. You have both after-tax money in the plan and pre-tax money because you've made after-tax contributions. The IRS said in 2014 for the first time, you can have the plan send your pre-tax money tax-free to a traditional IRA. That's a traditional IRA rollover to keep deferring the tax. And you can have the after-tax money sent to a different destination. You can divide the pre and after-tax money and send them to a different destination. So you can send the after-tax money to a Roth IRA, and that's a tax-free Roth conversion, basically. What's amazing about this flip by the IRS in 2014 is that for the past five years, they have said specifically, you can't do that. And all of a sudden, now you can. And so this is something every advisor needs to know about and make sure they are doing it with clients who are retiring.